croissants, chocolate, something vegan. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, it has no sugar. Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm going to be letting Instagram filters control what I eat for 24 hours. I previously filmed a video like this about eight months ago and you guys absolutely loved it. And what can I say? I love filming these videos for you guys. So I was like, say less. Let's go ahead and let's film a part two. So for today, we're gonna go over to Instagram and we're gonna have these filters control what I eat for 24 hours. Now I always start off the morning with some Starbucks, but I was like, hold up, wait a minute. Let's switch it up a little bit and let's do Dunkin' this time. I'm excited to see what we get but before we get started with this video don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up that helps me out a lot and it also lets me know that you guys want to see more videos like this also don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell so I can notify you whenever I post a brand new video without any further ado let's go ahead and let's get started so we're gonna start off the morning with some breakfast and like I said we are going to Dunkin now I know that's a little bit weird because I always start with Starbucks but today I'm gonna start with some Dunkin because I want to try something new I really don't ever come to Dunkin so I was like you know what let's try something a little bit different so I found this filter that says what should I order from Duncan so we're gonna see what we get so I'm gonna choose this filter twice because I want something to drink and also something to eat so here we go what should I order from Duncan we are getting a chocolate frosted donut now let's see what we get for our drink we are getting a Iced matcha latte. You guys know that I have a love-hate relationship with matcha. I might like this one. The one in Starbucks is kind of like sometimes I like it, sometimes I don't. So we're gonna see how the iced matcha latte and Dunkin' taste. So let's go ahead and let's order our food. May I please get a iced matcha latte? So I have my matcha iced latte and I also have my chocolate frosted donut. So we're gonna go ahead and try it out. That's what it looks like. Looks so good. Whoa, these are good. Okay, I gotta let you know, I'm not a huge fan of chocolate, but this, it's so good. It's like so dense, so moist. Like literally is falling apart of how soft it is. I'm gonna try the drink now because it's chocolate and chocolate always makes me really thirsty. So we're gonna try this out. I've never tried the matcha latte here. Who knows, I might like it more than the Starbucks one. Let's try it out. This is so good guys i might just start coming to duncan and it's way cheaper this size of a drink plus a donut was only five dollars and 36 cents at starbucks i probably would have paid five dollars for a tall which is like about this big to be honest i think i'm gonna start coming to duncan because it's good and it's affordable like hello who doesn't love that you know i gotta admit breakfast was bomb.com i was not expecting to love the ice matcha latte and the chocolate donut that much it was so good i almost finished everything i am so full so i'm gonna wait a couple hours until we pick up something for lunch but i want to go ahead and give a huge shout out to fetch rewards for sponsoring today's video now you guys know that i've worked with fetch rewards in the past before i personally use the app all the time and if you're not familiar with fetch rewards fetch rewards is an app where you scan your receipt and you earn points it's literally that easy and then later on those points you can redeem them into gift cards from like starbucks amazon target and more i really like guys that you don't have to worry what's on your receipt or where your receipt is from you just scan it earn points again it is that easy and you might be thinking but what if I do online shopping well don't worry because now you can also scan your e-receipts and if you guys eat out a lot or like me for example that I do a lot of videos and like I have to go to like McDonald's Chick-fil-a Dunkin all that stuff I always save my receipts because now you can scan your receipts from restaurants whether it's delivery drive-through or a dine-in so I always literally gather up all my receipts I used to throw my receipts away but not anymore because now I think about it I'm like why throw away my receipts when I can just gather them up scan them and then I can earn points and then later on they turn into gift cards and then I can go shopping I mean who doesn't love free stuff right think about it this way holidays are coming up they're around the corner you're gonna do all the shopping for your family members buying all these gifts don't throw away your receipts save them download the app and then scan them and then you can earn those points and then later turn them into gift cards and then maybe with those gift cards you'll buy even more gifts or you can buy something nice for yourself just for the holidays you know so I'm gonna show you guys how easy it is to scan your receipt let me show you when you open up the app for example here here says I'll get a thousand five hundred points for just completing any receipt and if you keep scrolling down it tells you that you can buy certain items and you'll get extra points for example if you buy Huggies you'll get 8,000 points if you buy the Huggies 36 count you'll get 12,000 points that's a lot of points if you ask me so I'm gonna show you how easy it is to scan your receipt you're gonna go ahead and line up your receipt you're gonna take a picture of that 
and then we're going to submit it. So I got a total of 1,505 points for just scanning this receipt. And you guys know that I always hook you guys up. So only for the month of October, you'll get an extra 4,000 points when you scan your first receipt if you use my code PETA. So if you guys want to go ahead and download Fetch Rewards, I'll leave the link down below. And thank you so much, Fetch Rewards, for sponsoring today's video. And all right, I'll see you guys in a couple hours when we go ahead and get something for lunch. 12 seconds later. It's been a couple hours. That donut and the ice matcha latte was so good, but I'm hungry again because if you really think about it, it was just a donut and a drink. It really wasn't that much. So I'm already hungry. It is around lunchtime, so we're going to go ahead and find something to eat for lunch. So I did find this photo that says, which fast food chain are you? And it has a lot of different options. So we're going to see what we end up having for lunch. So let's go ahead and let's try it out. Which fast food chain are you? So many options. Sonic! Whoa, that's a new one. I've never gotten Sonic before. So let's go ahead and let's go to Sonic and let's see what we order. So I ended up getting a chili cheese tot. And then I also got the all American hot dog. Again, I always get burgers. I was like, you know what? Today I'm just in the mood to try something different, you know, spice it up a little bit, try new things. So then I got the all American hot dog and I got the sweet tea with real strawberries. I'm hella excited because I always get the real strawberry slushy. It is literally my favorite thing from Sonic. I can come to Sonic and get nothing except the real strawberry slushy. You get me a large, you kill me with that. That is my weakness. I love it so much. Let's give it a try. Oh, it kind of reminds me of like a drink that is like a, some sort of diet drink, you know? I don't think I'm ever gonna get this again. I should have just sticked with my real strawberry slushy. I'm gonna try the chili cheese tots. Mmm, look at that. Oh my god, this looks so good. How many of you guys are playing Among Us? Let me know. I hear everyone talk about it. How it's so fun and like this and that. I haven't played it yet because I want to save it for a video. So I want to record myself for the first time ever playing Among Us. Should I do it? Should I not do it? Let me know in the comments down below because I've been wanting to play because Jason is already playing. Like he didn't even wait for me. I was like the audacity of this man to play without me. Like does that happen like your boyfriend or your girlfriend watches series without you and you're just like. Oh no you didn't. Oh no you didn't. You know. So that's how I feel. I'm like, you didn't wait for me. You just like literally played the game. He's like, everyone is talking about it, babe. I just you know, like, you know, had to check it out. And I always hear like the little sounds and him playing and like, oh man, him about being like an imposter and like crewmate and like all this stuff. So I really want to play it. But again, I'm trying to just like play it for the first time for like a YouTube video. So let me know if you guys would like to see that in the comments down below. Let me know because I would so be down to play that. All right, guys, the hot dog, the chili cheese tots, they were so good. The sweet tea, that's a whole different story. But I honestly feel like I am about to explode. I'm going to go ahead and wait a couple of hours because I literally feel like I'm going to explode. So we're probably going to wait a couple hours until we get something for dinner. So I will see you guys for dinner time in a few hours. Two hours later. It is dinner time. So we're going to see what we're going to have for dinner. This next filter that I'm going to be using, it says, what should I eat? So instead of telling you where to go, it basically just tells you like pizza, burger, cookies, ice cream, something like that. So whatever it lands on, that is what I'm going to be eating for dinner. So hopefully it's something really, really good. So far I've been having really good luck, but let's go ahead and let's try it out. So what should I eat? Let's see, what are we eating for dinner? Croissants, chocolate, something vegan. Let's do it. Let's look up something vegan. Google is always the answer, guys. So, vegan fast food. So I found something vegan. It is this place called Baby Greens and they sell wraps and it literally has nothing but veggies. No meat, no cheese, anything like that. It's literally just veggies. So we're going to go over, we're going to go to Baby Greens and we're going to get something vegan. So let's go. Just picked up my order from Baby Greens. So I got Sharon's wrap and I also got balsamic vinaigrette on the side and I even got an agua fresca. This drink is really interesting because it has cucumber, ginger and and celery. I've never heard of celery in an agua fresca, so I was like, okay, let's try this out. So that's literally the first thing that I'm gonna try. I wanna try the agua fresca, especially because it's super hot outside, and I feel like this is just gonna hit the spot right now. So this is what it looks like. Mm-hmm. 
Oh my God. Has no sugar. You know what? I'm not gonna throw it away because it has really good flavor. It just needs a little bit of sugar. So I'm gonna save it. So whenever I get home, I'm gonna put some sugar or maybe some honey and we'll fix it up. Now the wrap, I believe this is vegan because it has no meat whatsoever. It's just literally veggie. So I think that is considered vegan. Got a spinach tortilla. Have my vinaigrette on the side. How about we just cut it down the half? So let's see what's inside. Oh yeah, something about veggies. Look at that. It's carrot, lettuce, avocado, um, what else? Cucumber. Mm, it smells pretty good too. It smells healthy. This is this is super interesting because just a couple hours ago I was going in in a hot dog and with the chili cheese um tots and now we're eating vegan. Uh, but let's see, we're gonna try it out. You know what? I messed up because it gave you an option of adding tofu and in my mind I thought I did add tofu because I've never tried tofu guys never in my life so like the grilled tofu just sounded really good but it's still pretty good I feel like this wrap will be 10 times better with a little bit of ranch but I don't think ranch is considered vegan so that's why I chose um, the vinaigrette on the side but it's still pretty good all right guys, that concludes today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I had so much fun filming this video. I feel like we had a little bit of everything. We had coffee, donuts, we had hot dogs, and we went vegan. So I feel like this video was definitely so much fun. If you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also click that bell so I can notify you whenever I post a brand new video. Thank you guys so much for all the love and all the support. You guys are seriously the best. I love you guys so, so much, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ay, coming in, yeah. Flex, I just wanna win.